This is the Lock Picking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is the Master Lock Street Cuff. As you can see, this product resembles a large industrial pair of handcuffs, and what it's designed to do is to secure the frame of something like a motorcycle, RV, snowmobile to a secure anchor point. So the idea would be that one of these cuffs goes around the vehicle frame, the other goes around the anchor point, and because we have this relatively beefy, steel riveted bicycle style chain connecting the two, your vehicle is not going anywhere. Now, Master Lock apparently puts a lot of confidence in this product because with it, they offer a $3,500 anti-theft warranty. The idea is that if your, let's say, motorcycle is stolen, because your street cuff was breached, quote, by forceful means, then Master Lock will reimburse you the price of that motorcycle up to $3,500. Now, I included the term by forceful means because it is included in the fine print of the anti-theft warranty and probably does not include manipulation of the core. And I suspect that's with good reason because the cores on these cuffs are not hard to open. Now, both cuffs have tubular cores, but probably not like any tubular lock that you've seen before. Master Lock describes them in the literature as 10-pin tubular locks that are both pick and drill resistant. So let's take a look at these and then we will try to open them up. Okay, if we look closely, we can see there are indeed 10 pins in there. However, four of them are a different color. Four of them are steel colored, while the other six are brass colored. Those four steel colored pins are complete dummies. They don't do anything. There's no springs behind them, no driver pins. They're just there. So to pick this lock, you really only have to deal with the six brass colored rings, less than most tubular locks, which have seven. However, this lock is not like most tubular locks. As you've probably noticed, the center post is distinctly different. Usually there is a notch right at the 12 o'clock position there that allows you to tension the center post and turn it, which allows the lock to open. The center post on this lock does not turn at all. What it does is pop up like a button. The portion of this lock that you need to tension is a ring that is underneath the faceplate and is in fact shaped exactly like this faceplate. If you turn that ring one position to the right, this button will pop up and the cuff will open. So let me show you what that looks like when we're doing it with the key. We insert the key turn it one position you just heard a click that was the button popping up and the street cuff is open to relock it we simply close the cuff press the button and it's locked up <clears throat> so how do we open it how do we tension that little ring it's actually very very easy probably the hardest part of picking this on video is awkwardly placing this in front of the camera while I'm doing it. So what I'm doing is using the tip of this tension wrench to press against the ring to try to turn it. Since we only need to move it one position, we don't have to worry about the fact that this tension wrench can't actually turn entirely around. Okay, click out of one, nothing on two. I'm skipping over all of the dud pins. Nothing on three, four, five, six is binding, got to click there. Nothing on one, two, click out of three, click out of four, click out of five. Nothing on six, one set, two set, three set, four set. Okay, all these feel set. Maybe I'm just not pressing it enough. Oh, in fact, it was open. Let me move it just a little bit further. And we can see that button popped open. 
and the cuff is open and I have your motorcycle now. So a relatively easy lock to open once you understand how it works. Certainly not that secure of a product, not something that I would use to lock up any of my expensive vehicles, but there you have it. That's all I have for you on this Master Lock Street Cuff. If you have any questions or comments about it, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.